into the chicane. Out of the chicane. Now can Scott Mansell carry a bit more momentum down the pit straight and possibly have a go going into Redgate? Yes, he can, except that Spartan knew what he was up to and already had the car on the right place then to prevent Mansell from going past. Klaus Fart being very defensive there. The two of them absolutely nose to tail. Fantastic battle this. Downhill they go. The two 1997 Formula One cars. Down to the old hairpin. Again, Mansell looks on the inside again. Spart closes the door. Klaus Fart may be a few years older than Scott Mansell, but he's really being kept on his toes here by the younger driver, and he's equal to the challenge. For the moment, he's keeping Scott at bay. Up they come towards Coppies. Mansell has a look on the inside, but he can't really get past there. There are the leaders. They're in a new order. Scott Mansell has got ahead of Klaus Fart. We didn't see it, but it's definitely happened. And look at the way that Scott Mansell, now that he's ahead, is getting away from Spart. The lead changes and the gap opens up. Here is how it happened. Through the Craner curves they come. Scott Mansell carrying much more speed through the Craners. Finds a gap on the inside. Got a wheel on the dirt. Locked up. And Klaus Fart gave him enough racing room. Scott Mansell really on the ragged edge there. Smart back in the lead of the chicane and Mansell spins. Klaus Fart retakes the lead and then Mansell throws it all away. On the grass goes Scott Mansell. And Klaus Fart diving up the inside, but you can see that Scott Mansell then on the wrong line. The back of the car just starts to go. He corrects that moment. And there, on a much dirtier, dustier part of the circuit, there's just too much power for the grit. And round goes Scott Mansell. Klaus Fart then on his way up towards the chequered flag. He is going to win here at Donington.